Hi, my name is Jimmy Chin, and we are here in beautiful Jackson Hole, Wyoming. At, yes, at this point, for sure. So I'm wearing a Luminor uh, flyback. It's beautiful. It actually feels pretty good for tonight. My experience working with the Panerai team on the new submersible Chrono Flybacks was really inspiring on a lot of levels. It was a true honor to be asked to create my own you know, custom watch. Uh, I've always appreciated Panerai for its craftsmanship and design. And so to be able to work with the team and really kind of get into the details of a watch was really fun. But the process was unexpected and I really liked the way they approached it. You know, we really started talking about my background, uh, things that were really important to me, ethically, philosophically, and then from there really started to shape what the watch was going to end up being. I mean, the first one I actually wore and owned was a Luminor Due. And uh, I wore that to the Oscars. I wore that for a lot of the events. I wanted something elegant, a little restrained. It's hard to say that I have a favorite beyond the one I designed because I really love that one right now. And it's so new. I think, you know, as a watch collector, like the new ones, you're like, oh. Given my schedule and lifestyle, uh, the reliability of my watch is really important, particularly on expeditions where logistics and you know, the details matter in terms of scheduling and how you're moving and when you're moving. Everything's kind of based on time. So having a reliable timepiece is really critical. You know, part of the reasons I love being in the mountains is that it kind of changes your experience with time. Sometimes time can be totally dilated, slowed down, uh, but also, you know, a big part of the reason I go to the mountains is to be really present. That experience of being totally present in the moment can make a, a moment last really long, or it can have the opposite effect where time kind of disappears because you're so engaged and you're so in the moment and the day happens. And during that period, you're so focused that uh, time can also disappear. I mean, my favorite moment in the climb is in the climb, when you're in the moment and you're fully engaged and focused and just the sense of like being totally captured in the moment. When I think of the idea of going on expeditions, it's not always a literal sense of expeditions. I think, you know, I'm moving into narrative films is a new expedition for me. There's countless expeditions that I have in my mind that I would love to still do. And uh, I think, you know, trying to do one expedition a year at the minimum is always great because it really, we say it cleans out the pipes, recalibrates you to how you see the world. You know, time is something that I contemplate a lot, um, whether it's with my kids growing up or how I spend each day or how I spend each moment on this planet. I've always felt a certain urgency in life, and, and it's really how I've kind of directed the life that I live. It's just something that is captured in a timepiece. The best piece of advice I've ever been given is commit and figure it out. <laughs> That's a hard one. I guess I say every second counts, so maybe it's the second. But every day counts. Um, you know, I think time is truly our only um, real currency because you can't earn it back and you're only spending it.